What's up guys today's video is on the top 10 best space heaters, 2022, through extensive research and testing I've put together a list of options that'll meet we needs of different types of buyers. So whether it's price performance or it's particular use we've got you covered for more information on the products. I've included links in the description box down below which are updated for the best prices. Like the video comment and don't forget to subscribe. Now let's get started. 10th place. Polonus PH19J. To be warm, you shouldn't have to speak over your space heater. The Polonus PH19J is one of the quietest alternatives on the market, while yet providing decent warmth. Despite its small size, it warms up fast, reaching 70 degrees Fahrenheit in just 3 seconds. It oscillates to distribute the warmth, and it has vital safety features such as a tip-over switch and overheat prevention, so you can rest easy knowing nothing will catch fire. Ninth place. DeLonghi Dragon 4 Programmable Portable Radiator Heater. People may associate DeLonghi with espresso machines rather than household appliances, but their Dragon 4 space heater is among the finest on the market. The 1500W device has three heat settings and an easy-to-use timer, exemplifying the phrase set it and forget it. While it's not simple to use right away, reading the handbook for five minutes will clarify everything up. Using the turn dial, you may program the Dragon 4 to turn on when you know it will be very chilly such as in the mornings and evenings, but turn it off in the afternoons or when you are away. There's also a somewhat more costly Dragon 4 variant with a digital display, which may or may not be worth the extra money depending on who you are. Our California tester discovered the Dragon 4 to be exceptionally effective in a particularly drafty area of his home. With the weather outside in the 40s, our reviewer was able to comfortably sit at home with a shirt and jeans. Unlike with some radiators or ceramic fan-forced heaters, he says, I didn't feel that the heat was painfully dry or that it was frying me alive. It was also entirely silent, something you don't appreciate until you're trapped in a room with a screaming tiny fan heater. 8th place. Drio Solara Slim H3 Space Heater. Drio's tiny and sleek cylinder was possibly the most handy of the space heaters we tested. Our tester particularly liked the device's remote control, noting that it is quite sensitive and operates from 20 feet away making it ideal for turning on the heat on chilly mornings without getting out of bed. Our tester loved the remote's mute button even more than the basic controls, which she used to reduce the regular beeping noise that is a common annoyance with electric space heaters. Another noteworthy feature of the Drio is its memory function, as our tester observes that the heater remembered her previous settings and was always ready to reach her chosen temperature shortly after being switched on. Our tester also liked how the device's smooth appearance effortlessly integrated into her daily life, mirroring the heater's simple performance. While the Drio is small and portable enough to travel from room to room, our tester adds that it lacks the ability to heat bigger spaces. Seventh place. Vornado Heat Vintage Metal Heater. If aesthetics are important when buying for a space heater, Vornado's vintage-inspired heat is the clear winner. The heat substitutes a hefty metal body for the conventional plastic structure of other Vornado space heaters. It's hefty, but it gives it weight and prevents it from toppling over. Don't worry if it tips over since it will automatically shut off. While the outside gets heated when in use, it remains touchable. Don't be fooled by its appearance, the heat is more than just a pretty face, it also functions brilliantly. Toggle the switch between low and high heat, and use the dial to adjust the thermostat. Although you cannot set the space heater to a specific degree, having clear temperature markings on the thermostat allows you to obtain the desired heat level every time. Vornado's vortex action circulates hot air around the area, and while it won't evenly and rapidly heat up even a small or medium-sized room, it will warm it up enough to be comfortable. And, as a personal space heater, the heat will keep you warm. Sixth place. Honeywell Uber. Heat. Uber Heat by Honeywell is a simple small gadget that provides outstanding personal space heating. The Uber Heat features two fan speeds and a temperature dial, but our tester remarked that even the low setting kept things hot, resulting in what she called all-or-nothing attitude to warming. The Honeywell excels as a direct heat personal heater because to the high temperatures and lack of oscillation, but don't expect it to warm up a whole room. 
our tester found the Uber Heat to be incredibly simple to live with in terms of aesthetics, praising its speaker-like look and tiny size, which led it to blend in with her decor. When it's on, you'll know it's there since she characterized the fan as noisy, comparing it to a white noise machine. The fan also appears to be safer than many rivals due to a slew of safety features, such as a tip-over switch and cool-to-touch exterior, making it suitable for use around dogs and children. Fifth place. Lasco AW300 Bladeless Heater. The Lasco AW300 has a larger presence than other space heaters, but it looks attractive and performs well. It employs exclusive heat channels, which are trademarked and provide long-range heat projection. Because it oscillates, the heater can ensure that every part of your room receives adequate heat. Our tester also praised it for being simple to use and offering minor improvements over cheaper alternatives. It was straightforward to operate, with a digital temperature display and automated climate management, as opposed to more rudimentary space heaters that simply give low, medium, and high settings. Because there are no visible heating sources, it is safe to use around the accident prone. An A tower timer, an air filter, and a remote control are all included. The Lasco AW300 did not provide the degree of heat that our tester had hoped for. I prefer a space heater that feels like an afterburner, he says, but it did adequately heat up his area and looked beautiful doing it. Fourth place, Vornado MVH Vortex Heater. While we prefer the more expensive Vornado space heater in general, this less expensive model is a good substitute. The Vornado MVH is similar to the AVH10 in that it has fewer features but equivalent heating capability. There are three fan speeds and a thermostat dial with seven settings. Some users propose blasting the MVH on high speed with the highest heat setting, then lowering the thermostat and fan speed until you reach your preferred comfort level. Because of its quiet fan, this space heater is ideal for light sleepers, and if your room is small enough, you'll stay warm all night. Third place. Lasco 754201 Ceramic Space Heater. If you only need something to heat up a small room and don't worry about award-winning looks, the Lasco 754201 Ceramic Heater is a great buy. Our tester was blown away by this inexpensive compact heater's capacity to swiftly and effectively heat up a small room. Using it as the sole heat source in her drafty enclosed office, which, she notes, has seven windows, our tester claims the Lasco raised the temperature in her room by 8 to 10 degrees after a couple of hours, and her office was at balmy t-shirt levels of comfort within five hours of running the heater. In October, because of the strength of the heat, our tester had to keep the Lasco away from her desk and a little farther away than a personal heater, otherwise, it was extremely hot and drying. Despite its strength, our tester finds that the Lasco is still too feeble to heat bigger places, classifying it as a small room heater. Our tester was particularly impressed by the abundance of extra features on this budget heater, such as its multiplicity of temperature settings and tip over safety button, which she compared favorably to features on more costly space heaters she had previously used from Vornado and others. Second place. Dyson Pure Hot Plus Cool HPO1. If you're looking for a tiny household appliance, Dyson is almost certainly going to come up. One of our main reservations about recommending the HPO1 is that you're paying for more than you need, it's a fan, a space heater, and an air purifier. While it excels at all of these, the exorbitant price tag may put you off if you already have a fan or an air purifier. Because the HPO1 is a space heater, don't expect it to heat more than a single room. Many people have noticed, however, that if your home is small enough, like a one-bedroom apartment, the Dyson can definitely do a good job of heating up the whole space. And, because you can choose between long-range heating and personal heating, you may use the HP10 as a personal space heater albeit $499 for a personal space heater is a lot. It has the ability to oscillate and tilt, something many space heaters lack, and a remote control is always useful so you don't have to get up to alter the fan speeds, settings, or timing. First place. Vornado AVH10. After a while, all of the Vornado space heaters begin to resemble one another. The AVH10 stands out from the rest of Vornado's heaters because to its large number digital display and substantially powerful fan. The AVH10 offers two heat settings and a fan-only mode, so it can be used for both winter heating and summer cooling. The ability to set the AVH10 to a specified temperature is a significant advantage. Rather than utilizing a dial to set it to an arbitrary temperature, you can assure you're setting the gadget to the desired temperature. The wraparound cable storage conceals superfluous wires, which is a little but significant advantage. Many reviewers praise the space heater for its silent operation despite its tremendous heating capabilities. In addition to the standard safety features, the digital display counts down to exhaust any residual heat. This timer guarantees that you do not touch or move the gadget before it turns down. In summary, 
anticipate superfast heating and a somewhat even dispersion of heat around a space. Thank you for watching, and until next time, I hope to see you all in the next video. See you later guys.